Hello and welcome everybody to a brand new video of Automation. Today we are building a little 1966 pickup truck. And this is the body I chose because it's like in a little extended cab. But it's also got that little truck thing. And I think this is going to be a really cool build. It's perfect steel. You know, this is this is gonna be heavy duty, heavy duty truck from 1966. Cause you gotta you gotta be able to do everything with this truck. Monocoque chassis, corro mm, corrosion resistant steel, uh, front longitudinal. I want four by four on this thing. So then maybe we go transverse, but I'll go longitudinal for now. McPherson strut leaf, heavy duty. Inline four question mark? That's gonna be a big inline four. What if we go V twelve, V six, or boxer six? A bit of five point four liter straight four in here. Alright, yeah, we'll go five point four liter V six. Cast iron overhead three valve cast iron. Compression will turn that way down. Cam profile we might turn that up a little bit. Carburetor four barrel twin standard. I mean, we can go, like, a triple performance to COE, or we can go a two-barrel, single-barrel eco, uh, low-quality fuel, turn this way down. Yeah, I mean, I may, it may not even work at 2,000, so let's, let's just cross our fingers here. Short cast, dual exhaust, mess with that later, baffle reverse flow. Oh, there we go. You know what, I'm changing these to cast. Right, what can we get out of this thing? Oh god, make this super lean. This thing is gonna be like. It's gonna be, I don't know what that was. You know what? It's fine. The stress is fine. It's not gonna be that reliable, but whatever. Right, now, that is a truck stance right there. Okay, wait, hear me out. Hear me out. I'm, I'm, I'm doing some kind of spider thing. No, you know what? Forget this idea. Okay. Uh, all right. Time for a little bumper. Okay. Well, that's the front of the thing. Cool looking door handles and mirrors, wheels, tail lights. Okay, these tail lights are ruining the whole bed. Ooh, I have an idea then. Yeah, that makes it a lot better. But a bumper, a bumper, a bumper. We're done. This is gonna be a manual. Four speed. We'll go 145 for now. Manual locker diff. Wait, I forgot one thing. No, I didn't. It's hard. Long lifes. Steel rims. Drum. Drum to LS. Big. Drum SLS. Big. Off road skid tray. Standard. Standard. Hydraulic power steering. Standard 60 safety. Progressive gas monotube. Presley Chariot Stock. I'll see you guys over in BeamNG Drive. Hey, 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 here is the Presley Chariot. The bed cover glitches out the whole, like, rear end, but, eh, whatever. Ah, uh, that looks fun over there, so we're gonna try that. Oh, steer, gosh dang it. Oh, it doesn't have enough speed. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't have enough speed. Okay, what is this thing? Oh, it's a loop ramp. Oh no. Oh no. This isn't gonna go well. Oh wait, there's a ring of fire? Let's go. I'm going to that. Don't mind me. Okay, here's 
the ring of fire. Yes! Oh, we didn't make the jump. We made it through the loop, but we didn't make it to the jump. Skirt, skirt. Why am I in third? Actually, you know what? I'm going to low range. Oh, skirt, skirt. close enough. Please. Oh. oh, I don't think the suspension's supposed to be like that. It's going for it. Yes! Fire, I'm done with you. We got some regular jumps. So we're just gonna go through. Oh, this isn't a regular jump. Oh, oh. Barrel roll, that's a trick. You know that mobile game called Wrecked? Oh, another barrel roll? Oh my god. Okay, I don't want to go fast. Oh. Oh. I want to get like the minimal, like a minimal amount of damage going through this little jump here. Where's that rev limiter? Huh. Eat. No, what? I'm in Tamer Gang. I also compete in a stupid broken trucks league. Oh, come on. Anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video of our automation and beam and G series. Today, we built the Presley Chariot. It is a really neat little truck. Uh, it's got it's got a nice bed cover. It does glitch out the whole rear end, but make sure you guys click that like button, click that subscribe button, and make sure you guys comment down below what else you guys would like to see me build at all. Yeah, see y'all next time. Oh.